What's going on, my name is Elbrins. Welcome back to yet another reaction video. Today, we're reacting to Poppy, Poppy Playtime Chapter 3, the story so far. And literally, like I said in the previous reaction video, as soon as the th third chapter uh, re story recount recap came out, I react to it. Funnily enough, the same day I reacted to that video, this went live. <laughs> I could not have been able to time that any better. I really couldn't have, but I haven't been able to get to it. Well, I was going to get to it in the last during my last couple of recordings, but I had to stop because I had to go do something later Later, after I was done doing my recording sessions. And also, before anybody asks in the comment section, yes, I had seen the chapter uh, trailer for Chapter 4. They already dropped it, and they're already dropping information on Twitter. <laughs> so, <clears throat> I'm fully aware that Chapter 4 is currently almost done, and we'll be seeing a different version of the Smiling Critters in that chapter. But... Before we must grace the events of Chapter 4, we must grace the events of this recap. So, we're going to get right into it in 3, 2, 1, boom. Playtime <coughs> no security log. 0, 1, 2, 7. No reversal. <coughs> Triggered in cast reduction zone. Even dazed, I'm sure they must remember it all quite clearly. <sighs> Experiment 1188. Catnap. With nowhere else to go, and seemingly no one to turn to, there appeared only one way onward. This is where they encountered a most infuriating ally. Hey, infuriating. Hey, can you hear me? I don't want you to die, so I'm gonna help you. Oh, and by the way, my name my is Ollie. <laughs> After a short pass through the train station, our uninvited guests began their descent to Playcare, Playtime Co.'s own on-site orphanage, and Elliot's grand beacon of hope. Below, they received a key from their newfound ally, one that led directly to the still-beating heart of Playcare. The Red Smoke. To our guest, not all was told. But to leave, no. they had to redirect the gas. All that seemed left was the push of a button. And nothing worked. Oh no! Someone killed the power! Find the building's backup generator! Good luck! Hmm. The home sweet home. Once, Catnap the was a fixture of this place. At night, it was his red smoke that lulled the many children into slumber. But now, it had become a nightmare. His hunting ground. Trust is a funny thing. It can often be earned or broken in but an instant. But what we make of those who've broken that trust is a very individual viewpoint. Right. <laughs> Listen, I'm not your enemy, but I can't just let you leave. I need you, so we can get revenge on those monsters who've tortured you, who've tortured us. Power restored to the console. It's starting to wonder, were we, we weren't indeed an employee of Playcare, but we have, I think, no recollection of what really happened. Or our character has amnesia and was called back to the factory and only remembered the good times of what happened, not all the monstrous parts. It's still a mystery as to what kind of character we are. I mean, we know we're a worker, but what was our role in the factory? Like, were we a researcher? Were we a guard? Were we one of the factory workers? We don't know. Hopefully we get a, a, more answers to that in Chapter 4. The Master Battery in hand... <clears throat> The finish line. I'm sure that's how it must have felt. Before catnap attacked. The human mind is fascinating. Each wants to believe in its own sense of significance. Many live their whole life in ignorance of the truth. That's really their weak. But in a corner, sometimes we reveal ourselves as something more. And our intruder, there's something special indeed. Yeah, really? Yeah, right down the gullet. <laughs> Which inevitably brings everything back to our dear old Poppy. 
And with her was the truth. You came back because of your co-workers. This is your answer. We called it the Hour of Joy. The death of the every... Guilty. The innocent. The innocent. Didn't matter. The experiments killed everyone. Soon as we reach the bottom, we'll send the lift back up. Just hold tight, okay? Alright. We need to be cautious. There's something... No, no, no! Easy! Which brings us to now, doesn't it? Down they come, like lambs to the slaughter. <laughs> oh, this was two days, a couple days ago when their announcement. <clears throat> this was a build-up. This was a tease. Okay. All right. So there was some lore implication in these three videos. We weren't... It wasn't just a recap video. It was a recap retold by one of the events of possibly the protagonist of Chapter 4. Or the prototype, because we still haven't really heard the prototype voice in the game itself, only in the training sessions in, uh, oh my god, what was the name of the other game they made recently? <sighs> Why am I blanking on it? Project Playtime, there we go. Finally remembered it. Because <laughs> we only ever heard the prototype's voice in the training section when you play as the monsters. But question, because I haven't played it in in a long while is the voice that was doing these recap videos the same voice as the person who played the prototype in that training session because i haven't played project playtime in quite a while so let me know in the comment section below if they are indeed the same voice actor <clears throat> but overall i enjoyed this and i was right in my first uh reaction video to this that there was going to be lore implications so Tap on my shoulder for that. Um, but, I mean, it's not a significant lore implication, but it is an implication regardless. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's reaction video. Please like, comment, subscribe. And as more trailers for P Puppy Playtime Chapter 4 come out, I will be reacting to them. So Not the one that just came out. Uh, I've already, I already watched that off screen. It wasn't even that long, so I didn't bother doing a reaction video to it. But I hope you guys enjoyed regardless, so next time we'll be doing more Up Your Playtime stuff. And now that it's actually October when I'm recording this, we'll expect a lot more horror-related videos. So I will see you in the next video. Bye!